A top Qatari official is in Lebanon to seek ways to break a complicated political deadlock. Two of Qatar's biggest entities join hands for the planet. Qatar's iconic 974 stadium has inspired Belgian footballing authorities. And finally, a flare causes panic on the pitch during a King Salman Club Cup qualifier. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. Qatar's Minister of State Dr. Mohammed bin Abdelaziz bin Saleh Al Khalifi met with Lebanon's caretaker Prime Minister Najib Mikati and other officials in Beirut. Reports say the Qatari diplomat is seeking to break the ongoing political deadlock in Lebanon brought on by the inability to appoint a president. However, speaking to Doha News, analysts say that while Qatar's role is welcome and appreciated, they believe the situation in Lebanon is a little more complicated this time around. Check out our website for more analysis from Lebanon's ongoing crises. Now, Qatar Foundation's Earthna Center has signed a memorandum of cooperation and understanding with Kahrama to support sustainability efforts in Qatar. The pact aims to work on developing public policies related to electricity and water sustainability, as well as energy efficiency in the Gulf state. The two parties will also work together to find ways to reduce the consumption of electricity and water resources, while also bringing down harmful carbon emissions. That's a win for both Qatar and Mother Nature. Over in Belgium, authorities in the city of Chalois are reportedly in negotiations to construct a venue inspired by Qatar's iconic 974 stadium. The stadium in question is the 1895 arena, which is set to house exactly 1895 containers, similar to the innovative concept of 974. However, the Belgian version will be bigger, as it is looking to accommodate 65,000 seats. And finally, shocking scenes for Qatar Sports Club. An intense match in the King Salman Club Cup qualifier between the Qatari club and Tunisia Sfaxian was marred by controversy after ending nil-nil. Qatar Sports Club's goalkeeper fell onto the pitch when a flare was thrown very close to him by an angry crowd in the stands. Tensions even spread over to the Qatari side, with midfielder Bashar Rassam losing his calm in the second half of the game, throwing the ball at the head of his Faxian ball boy. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.